Vaccines are an important part in keeping us all healthy, not just kids. Adults need them too. They help protect against serious and sometimes deadly diseases. We sat down with a local family practice doctor to go over what adults need to be staying on top of and why. Most adults believe that it's a childhood problem. You know, pediatrics, all kids get vaccinated and the vaccines for adults kind of get lost um, because it's literally from 18 to all the way to 65 and beyond. So we don't think of it as something important. For under 65, everyone should get the flu shot regardless. Not only it protects the person getting the flu shot, it protects the very young who can't get the flu shot and protects the elderly who, even though they got the flu shot. And um, other vaccines, the tetanus, the Tdap, for example, um, it's important to get every 10 years, not just because it protects you against tetanus, but it also protects you from whooping cough. An adult is not very severe, it's more of an annoying cough. Well, children, on the other hand, get really sick from it. Other vaccines, you're looking at the pneumococcal vaccine. There's two different ones. They're given a year apart. Um, especially a specific group, asthma, smokers, COPD, you know, lung disease is huge in the valley. So um, they should get it for sure. Um, other people who can get it is heart disease, liver disease, and anyone with a bad immune system. So the Shinrex, which is a current uh, recommendation for shingles is given from, recommended from 50 and older. And it should be given to anyone, especially those who are unsure if they had chickenpox or not. Um, over 65 is already the pertinent group for them to be vaccinated. The difference with this vaccine versus the old vaccine is it lasts a lot longer, protects a lot longer. A lot of the disease that we encounter, usually people think they're fine. It, it won't happen to me. Um, you can also remember that viruses or bacteria, they don't discriminate. So even though you feel fine, tomorrow, the next day, you could be exposed and develop symptoms when, why develop symptoms when you could have been prevented against.